Alberta has become the fourth province to adopt the International Holocaust Remembrance Alliance's definition of anti-Semitism. Some say it's simply a symbolic step, but Calgary's Jewish community hopes it is much more than that. Chris Epp explains. Rabbi Menachem Matasov has been in Calgary for more than 40 years and says from his experience, anti-Semitism is rare. I like to concentrate on the positive and, and, re and realities. People are very nice, the community is very nice, very supportive on an individual level, on a community level. Still, Alberta's Jewish community is celebrating the decision by the provincial government to adopt the International Holocaust Remembrance Alliance's definition of anti-Semitism, the fourth province to do so. The statement says anti-Semitism is a certain perception of Jews, which may be expressed as hatred toward Jews. Rhetorical and physical manifestations of anti-Semitism are directed toward Jewish or non-Jewish individuals and or their property, toward Jewish community institutions and religious facilities. And I think this is something that the government of Alberta understands very well. This is far beyond statistics. This is about individuals that are being discriminated against because of who they are, because of what they represent. There continues to be anti-Semitic incidents in Alberta, whether it's graffiti on property in Calgary or hateful mail delivered to synagogues in Edmonton, the province hopes by defining the behavior that qualifies as anti-Semitic, there will be more awareness and fewer incidents. I, I hope that the opportunity is for us to be able to have the working definition and form policy for us to be able to work with communities. Now the next step is for us to speak to municipalities throughout the province and encourage them to also adopt the, uh, the definition. There is a statement in the Talmud, the recognition of the illness is half of the cure. The rec recognizing that it exists and that it's there is already, uh, is already a big accomplishment.